We had a plan before we had this coronavirus hit and everything shut down. We were going to be on the mission field starting at the end of June, um, early July um, at the latest. And we had to put those plans totally um, on halt. Um, we are really just in a season of waiting right now. Some of the things that we hadn't planned or expected in this season was finding out that I am expecting our fourth child. And that was not planned. Um, here we are hoping to be on the mission field coming in June and that got waylaid and then, oh, and here's a, a fourth child, which we're very excited about, but was not a part of the plan. You know, we know the Lord is in control of all of this, and our motto kind of during this time has been, He is not surprised, and He is still in control. And He knew this was going to happen, and so we needed to continue to trust that He's going to be faithful. And we knew that He had called us to the mission field, and He was going to take care of that. And so we decided that we were going to be creative in how we did our day-to-day responsibilities with our kids and work. We're spending really good quality family time. You know, it's been really neat to, to have that extra time together. Like each day is um, dedicated to some fun activity. And some, you know, take a lot of prep and some are just really easy. And we bought a slip and slide during this time and the girls have just been thrilled with it. Something I think has been a really big blessing for our three girls as they've really bonded. Um, together, which I think is great for our future being being on the mission field. So we are um, employed with Reach Global as our missionary agency, and we um, have been in constant communication with them um, as far as plans and next steps. Next. Um, and then with our support team, we've been um, sending out emails, newsletters. Uh, we did a lot of online Zoom um, conversations and. We've been really encouraged by the continuing support and prayers that we've had um, just flowing in. And we're really happy to know that we are at a place where we can um, financially be on the mission field when the time comes. And a verse that we've talked about is Romans 12, 12. Rejoice um, in hope, be patient in tribulation, and be constant in prayer. And those three things we feel like are really essential Um, to the Christian walk. I think it has made us more passionate to get on the field um, to share what he has done even in our recent history.